Yes, he did. Yes, he did. Yes, That's he did. next week with the reserves. Oh, so no, you no, we want to name the starters. We, oh, you, we're going to have to about. We're not going to have. I'm going to get bullied in. here. Uh, All right, wait, wait, here wait, you wait, go, Kenny, because you're wearing. Pass them out. We'll pass All right, them out. I just got. Bullied. How many envelopes you got? Four. Okay, so okay, uh, yeah, I'll do so the last. Yeah, okay. the last. No, no, hold on, Kenny. You have to read the first one. There's an order. No, here. I'm giving Chuck the first two. No, man. No, 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 no. No. You, no. Oh my okay, goodness. My bad, my bad. Chuck, there's first a, one. there's a. Oh, the captain. The captain. Read the captain. Okay, ready? Yes. Oh my goodness. What did I do? Yes. Uh, that camera right there. Yes. The captain. <laughs> He's 96 years old. He's oh. gonna become the all-time leading scorer soon. LeBron James. Wow, yes. LeBron James, his 19th All-Star game, 19 as a starter. It is a new record for the amount of All-Star games played in. A three-time All-Star MVP. It's his sixth time as a captain. He is 6-0 and oh as a captain, averaging just under 30 points, eight and a half rebounds, and seven assists. He passes Kobe with 19 All-Star selections and Kareem with 19 All-Star appearances. LeBron James, yes. what a career, Kenny. Uh, go ahead, Kenneth. Yeah, I, unbelievable career. The most astounding part is longevity. And not longevity in terms of the, um, the, the length of time that he's playing at this level. Quality of play. You, you, you could say that, you know, you, the debate about who's had a better 10 year it's run or championships, but no one has played as great as he is playing at this age. At this age, it's insane. No, there's no, no one in the world has ever done that. He is the freak of freaks. Mm. Uh, he is the, um, he's the model. Kid. And this is what he doesn't get credit for. He's the model citizen outside of basketball. If you want to figure out how to handle yourself outside of basketball, you watch what he's done over 20 years. There's never been a negative thing mm. about his family, his personal life, other than he made a decision yep. on TV that people didn't agree with. That's it. The guy off the court is the model person. Yeah, I've said this. Two things I want to say. Can we give a shout out to Kareem Abdul-Jabbar? Sure. Like, to have this record, uh, you know, he didn't shoot threes. LeBron shoots threes. To be that, I, I just think that when we, we don't appreciate how great he was. I mean, I mean, obviously LeBron is gonna break the record at some point, right. but this should be a reflection on how great Kareem was. True. What he accomplished. You know, you talk about championships in the NBA. You talk about all championships in college and things like that. So shout out to the great Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. But I want to pick it back on something that Kenneth said. I've said. I think LeBron James is the greatest basketball story ever, maybe in sports, to be honest with you, because he's the only guy, because as great as Kobe Bryant was and Kevin Garnett, uh, Tracy McGrady's, Dwight Howard, those guys, they all kind of struggled in the beginning. Yes. That's, he has 19 All-Star games. Uh, no, no, no. He only no. missed one but his I'm rookie saying, year. Though, but I'm saying, he played good his rookie year. Absolutely. And to go, did, to be... The guy from day one with all the pressure and expectations, and to, I've said this publicly, so to never get in trouble in today's society where everybody's out to get you at his yeah. level, it's the greatest sports story of all time. So congratulations to him when he breaks the record. Model citizen, I can remember first watching him in high school. I arrived in Cleveland, one of my fraternity brothers, so you gotta watch his kid play. And I, of course I knew he was gonna be in the league, but you know, he's, the way he has played, uh, his longevity, uh, you know, how, how he's done it. Yeah. Liked by everyone, loved by everyone, and he will pass the record at some point. And I, I must have to say, I, I'm professionally jealous. I would like to be at, at this point. You know, I've always said. Jealous of what? I've always said if I would have passed Wilt Chamberlain in points, I would have arrogantly said. I'm the most dominant big man ever. So I would like to be at this point right now to where I'm the, okay. the yeah. leading so scorer in, in league history. You're not Ben Kareem, right. Bill but, Russell. But I pass you up. Bill, that's all, but I pass you up. Uh, all right, David let's get Robinson. me to announce the rest. All Big country. I passed all Chuck, do you uh, have the other two oh, names? I, I, I got I'm one. Hey. Okay, I need Next. one of you to read, read pause, it. and then the other one reads. Okay, okay. so back to back. Kenny, okay. you go Wait. first. The first person, wow, this is a surprise, ladies and gentlemen. Not a surprise, however. Zion Williamson. Wow. New Orleans Pelicans. We got a wow. I did. Chuck, and then who do you have? Nikola Jokic. 
the two-time defending NBA champion, the Joker. What? All right, let's do the uh, the surprise the first. Two-time defending MVP champion. It is a second-time All-Star for Zion Williamson. This will be his first as a starter. He's averaging 26.7 rebounds and a career-high 4.6 assists. Mm. The Pelicans right now fourth in the West. He has missed 12 straight games, but when he has played, Zion has looked special. Zion. A starter for the West, and of course, back-to-back -back MVP Nikola Jokic, four-time All-Star. This will be this is fifth-time All-Star, third straight start, averaging 25-11 and a career-high 9.9 assists. His 15 triple doubles leads the NBA, and the Denver Nuggets at 34 and 15 are the number one seed in the Western Conference. But the story there for me. Zion Williamson named the starter. Surprised. Yeah. Only because of the injuries. You know, um, the numbers that you read are, are all-star starter numbers. Um, however, you know, if he played in these last 12 games, I don't think you, you would have wowed or we would have right. wowed at, at him being named the starter. Well, I have a problem with it. I said I didn't. That's the only problem. He I missed too many games. That's it. That's what. Uh, yeah, I mean, he, how many they, games has he missed? 12, last 12 straight. Last no, no, 12. but he'd missed some before then, too. Yeah. How many games does he miss, Mike? I yeah. mean, I, I, I was in this position a couple of times when I missed games, and I was still named the, the All-Stars. I'm not going to be a Do you want to do the guards? Hypocrite. Yeah, I want to do the guards. Yeah, I started. So, congratulations, Zion. Yeah, yeah congratulations That's to him. But All right, how many superstar. games has he missed? Yeah, just to answer the question. Yeah. Go back to back. back. So, yeah, yeah you back go back to, back to back. All right. My favorite player in the world, oh, Stephen yeah. Curry. Congratulations. And my second favorite player in the world, Luka Doncic. That is your Western Conference backcourt. Steph, his ninth All-Star, his ninth as a starter. He was the MVP of last year's All-Star game. Remember, he had 50 points and 16 three-pointers. This year, averaging 29-6-6, six and six, 18 30-point games. The Warriors right now 18th, excuse me, eighth in the West, but Curry, now a nine-time All-Star. And Luka Doncic, his fourth All-Star. He is just 23 years old. He is now a three-time starter. He leads the NBA Ooh. with a career-high 33.8 points per game. He leads the NBA in 20-point games, 30-point games, 40-point games, and 50-point games. Damn. He had that 60-21 and 10 game against the Knicks, and he is second in triple doubles. Curry and Luka, your two favorite players. You definitely can't be mad at this pick. Uh, two of the greatest players in our game today, dynamic players, uh, great one-on-one -on -one players. You know, All-Star Game is a, you know, the, we, we celebrate the greatest players in the league, but it's also a show. People pay a lot of money for us to put on the show, so those two guys in the backcourt shooting from way behind the arch would definitely be a great show. And I have no 